hello everyone welcome again to my channel welcome to another tutorial so today we'll be learning about this beautiful gorgeous beaded bag this bag is so beautiful look at how it's looking like very very beautiful you can take it to party you can take it anywhere if you put it in your hand all eyes will be on you it's a very beautiful beautiful bag and please don't forget to join my membership. The link is in the description box below with great perks. Thank you so much, you guys, for your support. So these are the materials we are going to use today. I have a fisted bead over here in yellow color. This is pretty yellow. Very, very beautiful. So I have a metallic gold bead in 6 millimeter, And I'm going to use both together to make the bag. This is my fishing line and I'm going to use in 50 pound. This is 50 pound fishing line. And I will have my little ply here to cut any loose thread. So I'm going to start off with this number of bead I put on the line. I have two gold bead, one yellow, two and one yellow. So I'm going to hold the other end of my line and pull it through the yellow bead and pull down. So I'm pulling through the yellow bead and pull it down. So this is how the first flower is looking like. And I'm going to repeat the same thing. So here I put two bead, metallic bead on one side and three on the other side. And I'm going to cross my end into this yellow one and pull the same way I'm going to repeat the same thing and I'm going to cross my end into this yellow bead and pull so this is how the pattern is looking like very beautiful again we are going to repeat the same the same way we did we are going to cross the other end of the line into the yellow bead and pull down so this is how we are going to continue to create until we have a long strap now this is the first row you are going to create it long because you have to make it long to make a bag. So using the same technique, we are going to add the same number of bead on this line. But at the same time, I'm going to add one gold bead on the other line. So this line, I'm going to add one gold bead on this line. And I'm going to cross my left line like this. This is the number of bead. And I'm going to cross my left line into this bead this is how it's looking like the weave is a beautiful weave again I pick five gold bead and I'm going to cross it into the last bead and pull and I'm going to go two step down, two bead down, and I'm going to add three gold bead. Two bead down, and add three gold bead. This is what we are going to repeat on this row. We are going to go down to. And add the number of bead we are adding so you go down and continue the same way 
create the same pattern until you finish to the end. Continue with your weaving, continue to go down two bead and add three bead to the left line and cross your right line into the left last bead. This is how the pattern is looking like and we are going to continue to the last row. So this is how the pattern is looking like. Very pretty and beautiful pattern. Okay, now at the end of this second row, I'm going to go to this gold bead over here. The last one. Go through it and pull the line. Now I pick four gold bead. This is the number that I pick, and I'm going to cross my other line into the last bead and pull. So now I'm going to hold this line and go down one step. So I'm going down one step, this line, I'm going down one step in this bead over here. And pull. And on this line, this is the number of bead that I'm going to add. And I'm going to cross the yellow bead with the other line. And pull. I'm going to go through next two bead and add this number of bead. Now next two bead. to the line and I'm going to cross my other end into the yellow bead and pull. Continue the same way until you come to the end of the row. I'm going to go through the next two bead. This is the number of bead that I pick and I'm going to cross the other line into the yellow bead. So you are going to do this, continue to create a mat, a big mat. So over here, this is the third line, the third row that we are creating. So we are going to continue to the end. We are going to continue we start with this, then we continue with the only gold bead, then we continue with the yellow bead. Now the next line is going to be only gold bead to the other side. You make it big. With this bag, you can make it to your desired length, how big and small you want it. So this is what I've created so far. And is this the size I want? And we are going to just fold it and make a bag. So I fold it into two, then we fill the side, both sides of it, and that's it. So this is the fun part we are going to do. This is how the mat is looking like. Look at the design. Very beautiful design. Beautiful, beautiful. It's how it's looking like. So I'm going to just fold this into two, and then I'll show you how we are going to do the side. So here I put this match of bead on the line, one yellow gold bead and one yellow. That's what I put on the line. And I'm going to go through two bead on the bag. I'm going to pull this through this bead 
and this one over here then on the other side so I'm going to hold the other end and go through two bead on the other side starting from this bead and I'm going to the second bead too and pull this two bead now on my line this is the number of bead I'm going to add to the line this is the number of bead that I add oh, three gold one yellow gold bead yellow gold bead and yellow bead so I'm going to cross into the yellow bead now this line I'm going to go to the next two bead go to the next two bead and pull and on the other line too I'm going to pull through I'm going to go back each and every bead over here on the line so I'm going through all the bead on the line over here so that I can go to the other side with my line so I'm going through all this bead and make sure you are pulling tight too so I'm on the other side and I'm going to go through the next two bead One, this is the number of bead that I add on the line and I'm going to cross the other end of the line into this yellow bead and pull then with this line I'm going to go to the next two bead And on the other side, I'm going to pull this line. I'm going to go through all this bead on the line and go so that I can have my line on the other side. I'm going to go through all this bead. Now I have my line on this side. I'm going to go through these two bead over here and pull. And now I pick up the number of bead again, then I'm crossing my line into it. We are going to repeat the same thing over and over on the side. So next two bead. going to hold this line and go through all this bead on the line so I can come on to the other side oh this is the last bead I'm coming through and I'm going to go through the next two bead you repeat the same this is how the side is looking like this is what we are going to repeat on the side repeat the same pattern that we are doing until you come to the end and this is the second side we are going to fill to just repeat the same technique that we use on this side and use the same technique on the other side too to complete the bag This is how it's looking like I'm about to finish this is how the side is looking like very pretty and I'm going to go through to complete the side I'm going to go through these two beads over here I'm 
going to go through the next two beads next two beads on this side too I'm going to go through next two beads This is how it's looking like and this is the number of bead I'm going to add to complete the row so that's the number of bead I'm going to ask for the last and to complete to complete the side of the bag like this you pull and pull your lines too tight this is just fancy party whatever you want to take this back to very pretty and beautiful so I'm going to go through this bead and come to the other side with my line I'm going to go through all the speed and this one too I'm going to pull it and go through all this bead and go to the other side so I can have both of my lines together and tie. That is what I'm going to do over here. And this is how this side too is looking like. Now that I have my line on both sides, I'm just going to tie over here. Tie and tie knit. So you just tie, pull it nice and neat, tie, and weave the rest of the line into the bead. So this is how both sides are looking like. Very pretty, very beautiful, elegant. This is a bow that I made and I want to attach it to the back to just make it so beautiful. This, I'm going to go through this bead over here with my line. Okay, this is my line and I'm going to go through the edge bead over here. I'm going to pull it through this one. Then I'm going to hold the other one and pull it through the opposite of that bead to be like this. And I will attach it on the middle. So I'm going to find my one, two, three, and I'm going to go through the middle bead over there. Find the middle and cross both ends of my line into it. This one. So here I'm going to go through this bead with the first end. And I'm, I'm crossing both lines into that bead and I'm pulling it. Okay just pulling it through to tie on the bag I'm going to tie the first one over here then I'm going to go through a bead and go inside the bag so I'm going to pull my line through the bead on the bow into the bag this one and this into inside the bag then i'm going to tie it inside the bag too i'm pulling my line through this bead okay this bead right here i'm going to pull my line through it again and now i'm on the other side and i'm tying both ends of my line in the bag you tie nice and neat and pull it through a bit to hide that knot then you trim it off with your cutter or scissors anything that you have this is how i attach it to the bag very pretty very beautiful it makes the it, it just give a pretty look to the bag 
So all is needed here is a handle and this is the handle that I've made that I'm going to attach to the bag to make it look complete. attach my handle this is the first handle that I attach to the bag and the back to I'm going to do the same to put the second handle over there the handle it depends on you if you want it long you can make it long for yourself or make it short or medium so this is the first handle that is done and I'm going to continue to put it on the second side this side of the bag to attach to it so that's all we are going to do. This is a very, very beautiful bag. Now the bag is complete. Look at how beautiful it looks like. The second handle too is attached to it. And it's looking beautiful. Please, if you want to learn more about how I make the handle and attach it to the bag, I encourage you to join the membership to learn more. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your time. And I really appreciate you. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.